We want to send a clear message to the Government of Canada. On October 23, 2013, the Innu, Maliseet and Mi'kmaq nations came together to send a clear message to Canada that they're united against drilling in the Gulf of St. Lawrence. There's clear unity. The Gulf of St. Lawrence should be protected for our way of life and uh, oil companies shouldn't be allowed to go into, that, into the Gulf of St. Lawrence for 13 years. Corridors has the license for the last nine years uh, at Old Harry. Right now, the Canada Newfoundland Offshore Petroleum Board is seeking a license exchange to give them another four years. And it's a very poor reason why. It actually uh, is a disgrace that they're doing this. They're saying they did not have the adequate time to consult with the Innu Mi'kmaq Malisee people, and now they want four more years. We've been here ready for that consultation. We united ourselves, organized ourselves uh, to receive that consultation and they have not sent us a document saying that here's the consultation. They're going back to Canada and they're saying we need four more years. And we're saying to uh, Jim Carr and to Justin Trudeau, that can happen. This would be an unlawful license exchange. Stop this exchange from happening. So another thing that, the, uh, that our alliance, the Innu Mi'kmaq Maliseet have been asking for is a 12-year moratorium. And people ask us, why 12-year moratorium? For us, it's clear by the time that Canada and the provinces come together and agree on a process, get that process underway, do the study and come back and show us the study, uh, have uh, first comments on it, go back, revise it, and then come with a full study, a study of the Gulf as one whole ecosystem, that's gonna take eight, nine, 10, 11 years. So we're saying a 12 year moratorium must be put in place so that they can do the proper studies and come show us this could be the effect on your way of life if we drill in the Gulf. This is key. They must do that.